there. Welcome to my channel. My name is Missy and as always, I'm so happy that you're joining me today. If you're new here, I hope you stick around and subscribe and become part of my YouTube family. I would love to have you. If you already do subscribe, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for all the support that you give me. So I hope you're having a wonderful day. Uh, it's a beautiful day here on PEI. The sun is shining and uh, we love it. So uh, I have a Dollarama haul today, a rather large one, and uh, some things from the Dollar Tree as well. Uh, I think it's just mostly food from the Dollar Tree. And uh, so let's just get to, and I'll show you what I bought from Dollarama and Dollar Tree. So I got a message, uh, I think it was yesterday morning from my cousin, Mary. Uh, we were chit-chatting back and forth on Facebook. And uh, she had noticed in one of my other hauls that I had uh, hauled an LOL accessory uh, package for um, little girls. And uh, she asked me if I still had it, which I didn't. I already gave it away. Um, so I went to Dollarama and I found something similar. And uh, this is just so cute. Uh, the little barrettes and uh, little hair bands and things like that. So, so cute. This was $4, and uh, I'm going to put this in the mail and uh, send it to her. And uh, they are going so quickly in every store, and it's no wonder she couldn't find it in hers. Um, they are so adorable. Yes, so that's the first thing that we got. Uh, I'm just going to pull my bag up here. I have two bags. So, nothing is in order at all. It never is with me. It's just kind of the way it was put in the bag. Uh, necessity, cling wrap. Uh, we use so much of this. And uh, like I said, it was a necessity. And uh, uh, $2.50 for this. Yes. So, that's the cling wrap. And then I had to get zipper seal bags. And there's 30 bags here. And I believe they were $1.50, I think. Oh, dollar twenty-five. Yes, even better. So uh, yeah, we needed these. My daughter bought freezer bags the other day from the grocery store, and they were really expensive. But uh, we did need the smaller uh, zipper seal bags as well. And uh, the other necessity that I needed was parchment paper. And if you've watched me for a while, you know I use a lot of parchment paper. And uh, this was two dollars, and it's the Betty Crocker. And uh, it's excellent. I love this brand and uh, I use it all the time. I go through so, so much of it. I'm just going to throw some stuff on the floor. So my husband went in with me. He was looking for painting supplies for his models. And uh, we, of course, start in the kitchen area. And uh, he doesn't normally go with me, but uh, he was a trooper and uh, stuck it out. But uh, this was $3 and he picked this out and it's a bamboo kitchen tool set and uh, you know your spatulas and your spoons things like that and I thought this would be nice on the counter and uh, yeah $3 for that and these were new at my dollar store and uh, he thought this would be great so we picked that up and uh, the other thing I got to send my cousin because I thought I better grab it before they're gone there was only a few of them left and they were $1.50, and it's the LOL uh, accessory set, the little mirror and comb and some hair bands. thought that was really sweet, too. So I'll send that with the other package. So, so cute. So if you like any of this LOL stuff, um, go to your local Dollarama and see if you can buy it. Like I said, it is flying off the shelves. It really, really is. Okay, so it's almost gardening time. And I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with Freddie's little garden outside. And if you don't know who Freddie was uh, or is, she is my little bird that passed away on New Year's Day. And I just want to do something really special for her in the garden. So uh, I bought some things to put in the garden for her. And this was uh, $3.50. And uh, it's a little lamb. And I thought this was so adorable. Yes. So, so sweet. And they had tons of these in the garden section. But look at the eyes. It's so, so pretty. Yes. It's very light. We might have to uh, maybe um, super glue it to a rock out there or something like that. That was my daughter's suggestion because it does get pretty windy here on PEI sometimes. So uh, we don't want these flying anywhere. So, so cute. She'd probably just adore that. 
the next thing I got because she is my angel, was my angel. Um, this was $3.50 and uh, isn't that just so sweet? Yes, I love this. And they had different kind of um, finishes. They were all white, but they had like, I think there was a, like a gray one there and then an all white one there. But uh, I like this one. It just is so special and it's special for little Freddy. So we're going to put that in her garden as well. The next thing we're going to have to super glue to a rock for sure. It's very, very light. But when I saw this, I thought this could be perfect for Freddy's garden. And uh, it's a little house. Isn't that sweet? Oh, it's so cute. They had two different kinds. They had this one and then they had one with um, a white door. But I thought this was really cute. And... Uh, she loved little things like this, so I know that uh, this will be perfect for her garden, but so, so cute. Absolutely love that, and I don't want to throw that on the floor. It will break for sure. <laughs> okay, the next thing that we got, uh, my husband, uh, I've told you before, he does models, um, tanks and things like that, motorcycles. And uh, he picked up this paint palette, and uh, it's metal. So uh, when he washes his paints out, they will come out. The uh, plastic ones I gave him, it just clings to the plastic and he ends up throwing them out. So this one he can reuse over and over again. And uh, I think he paid $1.25 for this. I don't have the price. It wasn't a lot of money at all. Okay, the next thing I got were some little hair clips for myself and they were $1.25. And uh, I just have a couple clips in today. That's how I like to wear my hair uh, lately. And uh, so I picked up some more of those. I keep losing them, of course. The other thing my husband got for uh, painting, they were $1.25 and uh, they're just the uh, little shot glasses and he can use these to uh, mix his paints in. And uh, yeah, very, very inexpensive for 40 of them, $1.25. The next thing I got, I hauled these, I think it was the last haul and uh, they're $1.25 and they're the uh, magnetic photo um, holders. And um, uh, I got them for my parents' pictures, and then I thought I'd pick up a couple more for um, hubby's parents' pictures as well. We'll put those on the fridge, but so cute. Or even, you know, I have six of them. I can even put uh, some of the bird pictures in, but uh, these are such a good deal. I really like them. Next thing was a necessity. My husband wanted this for the bathroom downstairs, $1.50, and it's just some floss. And uh, yeah, he picked that up. And then next bag. Um, I picked this up, I don't need it, but um, I thought my daughter might like it. And it's a makeup mirror with a LED light and it was $4. And uh, I thought this would be really nice for her room. And uh, I, I showed her yesterday and she said, oh yeah, she could use that for sure. But uh, it's by Lori. Anything by Lori is a really good purchase. I've never had a problem with any of their creams or um, anything like that or their products. But uh, yeah, she's going to really like that. So it'll be easier for her to put her makeup on. Oh, I, I ended up finding uh, more of these Barbie Hot Wheels. And uh, I think they were like $1.50. And... Uh, um, I did do the draw uh, and try to um, let the people that one know on um, that video, but for some reason YouTube didn't push the message through. So I'll talk about that at the end of the video, um, who won the giveaway. And uh, also I picked up another one of these little figurines, the baker. I figure if I see them, I'm going to pick them up because I absolutely love them. Yes. Next thing I picked up were some more of these uh, International Delight French Vanilla Creamers. 24 of them. They were $3.50, I believe. And these you can just put in the cupboard, throw them in your purse, your knapsack, and uh, take them on the road with you if you want to. Uh, last week we ran out of cream. I didn't realize. And um, these came in very, very handy. So $3.50 for those. Let's see. The next thing I got was another set of these and um, they're the peanuts uh, two pack silicone um, trivets and they're Snoopy and uh, oh my gosh I can't remember 
Woodstock. <laughs> yes, so we picked up another one of those. And uh, yeah, I thought they were really super cute. And uh, they were $4 as well. And they were where the kitchen towels are, things like that in the housewares department. They were cute. Um, what is this? So the next thing I got, I got for myself. And uh, I love a mint arrow. I don't really like a lot of mint, but um, if it's mixed with chocolate, I will eat it. And uh, yes, I picked up one of these. And then I was uh, telling you, I think it was the last haul or the one before I had cotton candy from the Dollar Tree and I really didn't think it had a lot of flavor. And I told you that I had bought a bucket. And uh, so there's the bucket of cotton candy and we are gonna try that today. And I think this might be the one we sold at the bulk barn, if I'm not mistaken, but uh, we're gonna try that today. And uh, the last thing in this bag is um, a shelf. And it's a wooden wall shelf. <clears throat> and it's got the three shelves on it. And uh, this was $4 and I am going to put this in my bathroom. I'm hoping hoping this fall I can redo my bathroom with most things from the dollar store that I found and uh, hopefully it works out well <laughs> but uh, yeah I thought a nice little shelf in there would be nice to have yes and hopefully I can put it up myself if not um, I can get my hubby to help so at uh, Dollar Tree I picked up the Sour Patch uh, lip balm and I picked this up for my oldest daughter and uh, showed it to her and she said yes that she would take that um, but I thought this was really cute and uh, I'll give that to her after I film today. The next thing I got and we're going to try today is, uh, actually I'll show you my glasses I got at Dollar Tree. These were $2.50 and uh, they're really cute and um, I really need to wear them right now to see this. It's a Sesame Bar Classic and uh, Sesame Plus and this was $1.25 when I picked it up I believe at Dollar Tree. And uh, we're going to try that today, too. And uh, pretty excited about that. I love a sesame snap, snap. If you've watched me, you know, I've told you I eat them every day. I give the birds a little piece. They love it. So the next thing I picked up at Dollar Tree was Spanish-style rice with uh, rice berry and red beans. And uh, we're going to try that today. Yes, I'm excited to try this. Um, I believe that... Uh, was it like $1.25 when I picked it up? Um, it was before the price increase. But we're going to try that today. And then I also picked these up for my oldest daughter, but we are going to try them today. We're going to have a snip and see if we like them. And uh, they're the sesame breadsticks from Aurora and uh, made in Italy. Oops, sorry, holding it the wrong way. Um, but yeah, I thought we'd try those. And uh, we'll give her the rest of them. She absolutely loves a breadstick. Loves a breadstick. The next thing I picked up at Dollar Tree, and I was excited to see them. And as far as I know, they're seasonal. Uh, we sold these at the bulk barn for way more than what the Dollar Tree wanted for them. I paid, I think, $1.25 at Dollar, uh, Dollar Tree. Um, but they are the coconut patties. And these are fantastic. I've had them. And I know that there's going to be a happy dance when I try them again. I haven't had these in a couple of years. There's two different flavors. The other one's green. I think it might be lime or something like that. Lime coconut. But if you have not tried these, these are amazing. If you like coconut and chocolate, grab yourself one of these next time you're at uh, Dollar Tree. They were at the cash. And like I said, I think they're seasonal. I could be wrong. I know at the bulk learned they were seasonal for summer. And, uh, oh, I forgot one thing from Dollar Dollarama, and this is a sign, and I absolutely love this, and I can't believe I got it at Dollarama. What I love most about my home is who I share it with. Isn't this just wonderful? It's, it's heavy. Uh, it's an absolutely beautiful, beautiful wood color, and it uh, looks like a little house. I absolutely love this, and I'm going to put this at the front door. Yes, I'm going to put it at the front door. But uh, I bought this a while ago. I've been hanging on to it uh, in the back, and um, I thought I would share it today. I saw them at my Dollarama yesterday, so they still do have them. So if you like this, grab one before they are gone. Um, just lovely. $4 for this. 
Yes, I just love it. I think it's just wonderful. I really do. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to go clean my mess up and we're going to come back with uh, a taste test. And I'm also going to talk about the winners of the last two giveaways. And I'm actually doing another giveaway today and I can't wait to show you what I'm giving away. So I will be right back. Okay, I'm back and uh, I just want to talk about the winners from the past two giveaways first before I forget. But I did draw three names for this set here, the little figurine and the Barbie camper. And uh, that was one of the draws. So there was three names drawn. And the other one was for uh, this LED light, the um, oven mitt set, and this little love sign. And um, what I'm going to do is under this video in the description box, I'm going to put who the winners were for, for uh, the Barbie camper and the figurine and then the last one I did. Um, that's how you'll know if you won. And I will leave my email down there if you could get a hold of me so I can send these out immediately. I want you to get your um, giveaway prizes. And uh, so I will do that for you. And... Uh, uh, after I do the taste test, we will talk about the giveaway I'm doing today. So just check down in the description box to see if you won in the last two giveaways. So let's do this taste test. Now this is hot. I just microwaved this. This is the rice. And uh, this was from the Dollar Tree. And it's got beans. It's almost like a Mexican sort of rice. And uh, we're going to give it a try. It is very hot, though. Ooh, shaking there. Let's have another bite, just to make sure. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Let me just have a sip of my lemon water. Isn't that cute? Mm. So, I like the rice. I'm not going to write home about the rice. Um, it's good, but it needs salt. Like, there needs to be a little bit of salt added to this um, after you make it because it is really bland. But uh, the taste is there. I like it. I like the beans in it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yes. It's worth the dollar twenty-five. You could throw some chicken in there, uh, whatever you want, but make sure you add a little bit of salt if you like uh the flavor of salt, that is. Um, I do, and that's what I would add to it. Maybe a little pepper too, if you like that. Okay, so moving right along. We are going to try these um, sesame bars, and uh, I know some of you uh, panicked when I used a knife last time. Um, I never even think about almost cutting myself or anything. I just do it. I promise uh, to try not to cut myself. Okay, so there's the bar, and uh, we'll just snap a little piece off. Mmm, mm-hmm, mmm, oh, mmm, mm-hmm, oh, that is fabulous, fabulous, it's different than the sesame snaps or the ones they sell at Dollar Tree, or Dollar Rama, sorry, um, it's more like a sesame uh, snap granola bar, that's the kind of consistency because it's thicker, Mm, 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 the birds are going to love it if I share it with them. That is a good bar. And I think I bought a few of them. Um, I think I did. I think I bought three or four of them. So moving right along, we're going to have some cotton candy. Yes, we are. And, uh. These buckets are so cute. They're perfect for little parties, um, like a birthday party or something like that. Or if you have a candy table at a wedding, 
perfect. Let's give this a try. My tongue's going to be blue after this. Mm-hmm. 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 This has flavor. Uh, the one from Dollar Tree that I got last time really didn't have much flavor to it. This is from Dollarama. And uh, I'm just going to try if I can get to the pink. I'll try a bit of the pink. Yes. Mm-hmm. 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 I love candy floss. It's not going to be as good as you get at the fair. That's for sure. But uh, for a party, absolutely great. Um, you can take this to the beach with you and use the bucket after. Perfect. I love this. Absolutely love it. The last thing that we're going to try before we talk about the giveaway today is um, coconut patties. And I already know there's a happy dance coming on because I love these. Anything coconut. And that's what they look like. I remember when I worked at the bulk barn, the sun would come in the front window in the morning and I had to, to scram to get these out of the way of the sun because they will melt and they melt fast. But uh, isn't that a nice little chocolate bar? And you get two of them. You get two in a package. And let's cut a little piece off here and uh, try it. Oh, I need another piece. Oh, the flavor. This is better than a bounty bar. Um, better than the other coconut bars you would buy at, say, Dollarama. This is amazing. And, uh, oh. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 I'm going to eat the rest of that after I finish filming for sure that is so good yum mm. yes so uh, the giveaway the giveaway that I'm doing and I will draw in two weeks from today for the giveaway and uh, it's my anniversary today uh, it's our wedding anniversary and I feel like I want to give something away and uh, you guys are such great subscribers and friends, and uh, I just want to give you something. So I will only do one draw, and uh, you have to be subscribed to my channel, and just leave a comment. It doesn't matter what it is. Just say hi, whatever you want. So leave a comment and be subscribed to be able to uh, be eligible for this giveaway. And this is not affiliated with YouTube at all. This is just something I want to do for my subscribers. So... I am, let me get it out here, I'm going to be giving another one of these LED lights away and uh, like I said it can strobe, flash, uh, run through the colors, you can have a solid color, um, it has a USB and a remote control. The, what's going to go with this is the uh, two piece uh, oven mitts, the mini uh, peanuts oven mitts and uh, so that's with that. And then also with this, I'm giving away the Minnie and Mickey Mouse. Yes. So you're getting all three of these things. Uh, one winner this time. And um, I can't wait to see who wins this. But uh, good luck, everyone. And uh, like I said, two weeks from today, I will do the draw. And uh, I will try to comment on your comment if YouTube lets it go through. If I don't hear from you, um, then I will... Um, let you know the following video that I do after the giveaway. So uh, good luck. That's all I have for you today. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please subscribe and hit the like button. And uh, bye for now.